in this vid video tutorial we are going to show you how to configure hotspot um, uh, from our previous video we configured our Microtech 951 uh, manually so that our bridge bridge one that's where the DC, DCP server will be running uh, we want to create hotspots and we'll create another bridge and add port for example the one port the wireless port the wireless port um, and port number four so that um, the hotspot will be running on those ports so what we'll do is we'll create a bridge <coughs> we'll create a bridge let's say bridge to our hotspot then we add the ports that you want we can add port number four so you need port number four and port the wireless interface port that is VLAN 1 so I'll add VLAN 1 to bridge hotspots before you add it you have to remove it because we add it to bridge 1 so you remove it you remove that port and we'll move port number 4 then add them to bridge 2 I add to hotspot bridge then I add also port number 4 port number 4 port number 4 to hotspot bridge so we have our ports so number 4 and the wireless interface uh, that's where our hotspot will be running so what we need is to you go to the addresses then you create a pool <coughs> address list for the hotspot so hotspot will be using IP number 57 that, that range 192.168.57.1 so we are running that on uh, the hotspot bridge click apply okay then we go to the IP hotspot then you'll click on under servers you click on hotspot setup so we select the interface the hotspot interface which is our interface hotspot the one we created then under that because we had uh, we we added the the ip to address list so we'll be able to select the ip addresses from there <coughs> then just click next under certificate none we are not using any certificates for authentication uh, ip addresses mp server zero nothing then the dns name this is the name that will appear uh, once you connect to the to the hotspot on your browser so let's call it tech.net I love it in caps tech.net then next so by default when you create a hotspot there is that user that microtech will create for you for the hotspot it's admin and uh, it doesn't actually have a password so you can add a password let's say let me have a password as the one two three for the admin user click next okay we are done with the configuration of the hotspot so if you go to the profiles you can create profiles we have the default profile by default whether it is assigned for mbps but we can create our own profile let's say for our hotspot we'll assign a uh, two mbps that's a single uh, profile that we'll create then under address pool that's the pool that it will be picking the ip and assigning the users we choose the hotspot pool then you click okay there's also one thing if you want your hotspot your users to be authenticated once they disconnect they can be authenticated using the cookies or reconnect using the cookies so that 
uh, with cookies that is, it, it remembers the browser will remember your your browsing history so with cookies it will enable your user to access your micro tick once they disconnect so we can uncheck that so that every time they are out of range of your 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 hotspot they love to enter their username and password or you can just check add mark cookie so that they can just connect automatically uh, for now we'll disconnect these and check that uh, box then we you can also assign the uptime if you want to but we'll just leave that uh, for now so click ok apply ok then users need to create a user let's say test user so our test user under general we have servers you select the hotspot server then user we can call our user test password we can have it as one two three uh profile the profile that we created to mbps limit if you want to limit your the uptime for example one day so you can just click here and type one d then space small d that means one day so after a day if they are continuously connected for a day uh, they will disconnect or the hotspot will disconnect them once they are connected for a day okay you click ok apply so we have our test oh, sorry test should be uh, written it as test test okay let me apply okay then um we have the server profile tech yeah, okay with these you want to confirm everything so we have our users our user which is test user and the profile which is two mbps now i'll switch because i'm using ethernet i'll switch to port number four which you configured uh, to run the spot and see what happens to the computer there should be a pop-up i will be redirected as you can see i'm redirected to the login page the microtech hotspot login page because we created our user we have our user test caps okay we need to log in and see if we are connected then one two three as password so as you can see we are connected now we can access internet go to youtube yeah we are connected i think we should search our channels man josh Yes, we can access YouTube. We are using a Welcome and to my YouTube we are connected channel. using Today, a I want to show you how to configure so that is a way deep on router. I want to configure okay. to a such a way that so in the next tutorial we will show you how to create PPPoE and run it on the hotspot interface. So port number four and the one the wireless or WLAN one interface so feel free to subscribe to our channels uh, like our videos uh, leave comments and you can also suggest give us suggestions on what you need us to do or what we can configure or what we have done wrong